This is a lady who even the New York Times is pointing out is not really qualified for the gig. Look at the headline in the weekend edition of the New York Times. Kamala derided as out of depth, may now lead the ticket. So the New York Times knows she's no good. She's really not good on international policy. I mean, she got a big opportunity to go over to Poland. We're going to show you that clip. But before I do, do you remember her history and geography lesson that she tried to give everyone? Wow. Ukraine is a country in Europe. It exists next to another country called Russia. Russia is a bigger country. Russia is a powerful country. Russia decided to invade a smaller country called Ukraine. So basically, that's wrong. Oh, I mean, gosh, she could give Dr. Jill a run for her money, couldn't she? So there's the, the history geography lesson about Ukraine, small, Russia, big. And then there was, oh, um, another one, like that time that she tried to show off her foreign policy chops and tried to explain how smart she was while in Warsaw, Poland. We all watched the television coverage of just yesterday. That's on top of everything else that we know and don't know yet based on what we've just been able to see, and because we've seen it or not, doesn't mean it hasn't happened. But just limited to what we have seen. I mean, it's like she doesn't speak the same language as us, does she? She takes so many words to say one thing. It's rather remarkable. Really, really remarkable. You know, English is actually a pretty efficient language. If you had a bigger vocabulary, lady, you could actually get to the point. But no, 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 she meanders and says the same thing over and over and over again. I don't know what it is, but somebody's gonna work with her on that. In the meantime, Tulsi Gabbard is no fool. Tulsi tried to take her down. Of course, you saw what they did to Tulsi. Tulsi was suddenly a Russian spy because, hey, they go back to the well. You're either you know, racist or you're a Russian spy or misogynist or who knows what, but you know, they got the Russian spy. This poor woman, she's a former vet. Tulsi's great, by the way, and she's over here on, on our side of things where she's streaming and she's just a thousand percent her own person, so we love her for that. Anyway, watch her here, former Democrat, Tulsi Gabbard. Now, Senator Harris says she's proud of her record as a prosecutor and that she'll be a prosecutor president, but I'm deeply concerned about this record. There are too many examples to cite, but she put over 1,500 people in jail for marijuana violations and then laughed about it when she was asked if she ever smoked marijuana. She blocked evidence. She blocked evidence that would have freed an innocent man from death row until the courts forced her to do so. She kept people in prison beyond their sentences to use them as cheap labor for the state of California. And she fought to keep cash you, bail system in place. That impacts poor people in the worst kind of way. Thank you. And yet this is the person that they are going to run. In other words, unelectable, unelectable, ladies and gentlemen. And yet this is going to be the person at the top of the ticket. Is this how you finally get your woke, super lefty, California senator, minority woman, Barack Obama? I mean, since you're, and then, oh, you know, we've talked about Michelle before. Maybe then she passes the torch to Michelle. This is very, very strange how it's all going down. 